good name is more to be desired than great wealth, and to be respected is better than silver and gold. The man of wealth and the poor man come face to face. The Lord is the maker of them all. The sharp man sees the evil and takes over. The simple go straight on and get into trouble. The reward of a gentle spirit and the fear of the Lord is wealth and honor and life. Thorns and nets are in the way of the twisted. He who keeps watch over his soul will be far from them. If a child is trained up in the right way, even when he is old, he will not be turned away from it. The man of wealth has rule over the poor, and he who gets into debt is a servant to his creditor. By planting the seed of evil, a man will get in the grain of sorrow, and the rock of his wrath will be broken. He who is kind will have a blessing, for he gives of his bread to the poor. Send away the man of pride, and argument will go out. Truly fighting and shame will come to an end. He whose heart is clean is dear to the Lord, for the grace of his lips the king will be his friend. The eyes of the Lord keep knowledge, but by him the acts of the false man will be overturned. The hater of work says, There is a lie outside, I will be put to death in the streets. The mouth of strange women is a deep hole. He with whom the Lord is angry will go down into it. Foolish ways are deep-seated in the heart of a child, but the rod of punishment will send them far from him. He who is cruel to the poor for the purpose of increasing his profit, and he who gives to the men of wealth, will only come to be in need. Let your ear be bent down for hearing my words, and let your heart give thought to knowledge. For it is a delight to keep them in your heart, to have them writing on your lips, so that your faith may be in the Lord. I have made them clear to you this day, even to you. Have I not put in writing for you thirty sayings, with wise suggestion and knowledge, to make you see how certain are true words, so that you may give a true answer to those who put questions to you? Do not take away the property of the poor man because he is poor, or be cruel to be crushed once when they come before the judge, where the Lord will give support to their cause, and take the life of those who take their goods. Do not be friends with a man who is given to wrath. Do not go in the company of an angry man, for fear of learning his ways and making a net ready for your soul. Be not one of those who give their hands in agreement, or of those who make themselves responsible for debts. If you have nothing with which to make payment, he will take away your bed from under you. Then not the old landmark be moved which your fathers have put in place. Have you seen a man who is expert in his business? He will take his place before kings. His place will not be among low persons.